continue to be crippled following delayed disbursement of county allocation revenue. The governors are now making a passionate appeal to the national government and the treasury to move with speed and release the funds to prevent a total shutdown of operations at the counties. And as a reporter on pretending now files, the council also wants an assurance that their issues will be articulated at the national level, even in the absence of devolution ministry. <laughs> As they settle in the office one month after being sworn in, the Council of Governors under their chair Kriyaga Governor Anwai Guru are evidently a worried lot. The devolved unit's financial coffers have dried up and this is a major concern. While we are cognizant that we are in a new political dispensation, as county governments, we are duty bound to provide smooth and uninterrupted service delivery to every citizen. However, the council is concerned that despite being in the midst of transition, the current financial situation across the 47 county governments is devastating. Under the current constitution dispensation, the national government through the treasury must facilitate prompt disbursement of revenues to county governments to enable smooth service delivery. According to the Council of Governors, this has not been happening for the past three months. The total outstanding areas owed to counties stands at Kenya shillings 51 billion 762 million 201,733. Now, the governors want the government to move with speed to arrest this situation that is threatening to blow out of control. The council therefore calls upon the national treasury to release all the outstanding disbursement to counties on or before Monday 10th October 2022. Even as they urge Treasury to urgently intervene, they remain worried that further delay will have unprecedented adverse effects on the functioning of counties. So far, the continued delay in disbursement of fund, funds has paralyzed county operations in respect to the following. One, payment of salaries to county officials.